Here's a sneak peek of the Emco CNC5 turret running uh, controlled by Centroid's Acorn uh, motion controller. The only thing that I did to the turret is I added a small Hall effect sensor on the back of the turret. This is for testing, but something more permanent would be installed. But this is so that the control can find um, position one on the turret. That's all that does. It's a little magnet stuck on the retaining ring on the back and then a Hall effect sensor on the back. And then for um, control, um, using uh, this output two from the Acorn board, and it's firing a double pole, double throw relay. And I have a 12 volt power supply connected here. That provides the forward motion through that relay to the turret motor. And then here I have a small DC to DC uh, converter. So it takes 12 volts and then turning that tiny little pot right there, I've adjusted it to about three and a half volts. And that provides the reverse voltage to the turret motor. So let's go ahead and uh, it works like the original Emco. Um, it uses time. So here I'm going to go ahead and hit cycle start and it's just going to run through a sequence of tool changes and I have a four second pause between the pull chain tool changes. So it's already at tool one. Now it's going to go to tool three. The next move is tool five. Now the next move is tool two. And then you'll see the next move is tool four, tool six, and then tool one. And it seems to be working quite reliably. Now, uh, uh, the tech at Centroid has got the control to remember the last tool location or the tur tool turret position. So when you power down the turret, I'm sorry, when you power down uh, the Centroid Acorn control, when you power it back up, the control remembers where the last position is. Now, I can home this just by homing the machine or pressing that reset home button. Um, let me demonstrate that for you real quick. I'm going to call a tool change and get it away from tool 1. Go T0202 and cycle start. Okay, so now what we'll do is just do a reset home. Gotta get out of MDI. Now we'll do a reset home, and you'll see it's going through its M18 is to home the turret. So it's going to home that turret back to tool one. And there you go, it's a quickie video of the uh, sensorless tool tool. I say sensorless, that's tool position. It has a sensor for tool one, the MCO5. Uh, tool changer working under Centroid Acorn CNC.